That's right. It is a little confusing, random rooster. Cockadoodle, oops. Oops. What happened? Did, was he not supposed to wake someone up? Did he forget to wake someone up? What's this oops all about? Let's find out. Farmer McPeeper was such a deep sleeper, not even an earthquake could shake him. Whew. I bet some of you are like that, aren't you? A poke or a pinch wouldn't budge him an inch because only his rooster could wake him. And there he is right there. There's the rooster waiting outside. And this, look at the, look at the farmer. That's a very unusual snore pattern. Then early one morning, without any warning, rooster delivered a speech. I've saved up my money to go someplace sunny. I'm taking a trip to the beach. I have it all planned. I'll play in the sand. My feathers will blow in the breeze. I'll run in the sun and have buckets of fun. I'll sleep just as late as I please. He's a very refined rooster, I decided. Oh, we don't want you to go. If you do, who will crow? The animals cried. This is bleak. You'll each take a turn till the day I return. I'll only be gone for a week. <coughs> well, I mean, you all can take up wake up duties for a week. I mean, look at how many there are of you guys. They, you all don't even have to do the job. There's more than seven of you. Come on. Who? Yes, you. Who? Who? You. Uh, I'm sure I could do it. There can't be much to it, said Pig as he wallowed in mud. This is Monday. It's Pig's Day. He snorted with squeal. Cock-a-doodle squeal! His oint was an absolute dud. Oh, boy. And look at that. Zzzz. Farmer McPeeper. Is that his name? I always forget the names. I'm so bad that way. Yep. Farmer McPeeper. He didn't wake up even a little bit. All right. It's Tuesday. Sheep Tuesday. I know that I'm quiet, but I'd like to try it. Here goes, said a shy little sheep. Her cockadoodle pa didn't travel too far. In fact, she made barely a peep. Everybody's looking. Who? Uh, hmm. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Yep, that's right. That's not working either. Farmer sleeping still. Did he ever wake up the day before? Oof. The farm may be in trouble. It's Cow Wednesday, people. Bovine Wednesday. I'll teach you all how. I'm a talented cow. Step back and learn from the master. Okay, he's a confident fellow. A one and a two and a cock-a-doodle moo. Boy, what an utter disaster. Everybody looks pretty stunned, except Farmer McPeeper, who is unfazed. <coughs> it's Chicken Thursday. Next, Chicken chimed in. Back, back. You know, rooster is my kin. You see, we're two birds of a feather. Her cock-a-doodle clock didn't have any pluck. She blamed her weak voice on the weather. You see, it's, it's, it's humid and, 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 and I get a frog in my throat. And uh, also, um, I'm also extra tired on Thursdays. Okay, okay, hen. Now next, Friday was for Mule. Mule took on the task, though he had to be asked. Oh, no volunteering, huh? As a matter of fact, it took nudging. That's more than nudging. He opened his jaw. Cock-a-doodle, hee-haw! His bray was a flop. But who's judging? Not me. No, not me. It's Goat Saturday. Mmm, Goat Saturday. I'll show you, said Goat, after <laughs> clearing his throat. I'm not just a kid anymore. His cock doodle bleat just couldn't compete with Farmer McPeeper's loud. <laughs> Snore. <laughs> oh no. What's happening? Did the farmer ever wake up? I haven't seen him appear once. It's Owl Sunday. Ooh, 
owl. Who owl? Don't throw in the towel. Encouraged old owl. I know I can do the job right. Her cock a doodle hoo just didn't ring true. It's a fact. Owls hoot better at night. I mean, we're not judging you or anything. It's just, it's it's a fact. You're you're night people. Oh, thank goodness you're back. No time to unpack. You've got to wake Farmer McPeeper. We each tried to crow, and by now we all know McPeeper's a very deep sleeper. Rooster coughed, <laughs> and he sputtered. <laughs> He wheezed, <laughs> and he muttered, 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 muttered. There's something I think you should know. <clears throat> the damp ocean breeze made me sniffle and sneeze. My voice is so weak, I can't crow. <gasps> oh, jeepers, McCreepers. McPeepers is gonna stay a sleepers. Oh no! It's hopeless, said Goat. If he's got a sore throat, his crow will be too soft to hear. Since Rooster can't do it, and each of us blew it, he'll probably sleep for a year. <gasps> I've got it, said Cow. We can wake him. Here's how. We'll call from the phone in the shed. Rooster's crow will be near him, so Farmer will hear him. Let's hope there's a phone by the bed. You guys had a phone in the barn the whole time? <laughs> Poor Rooster. Poor thing, don't you hate it? When you go on vacation and you get sick? Oh, it's the worst. Well, Rooster pecked on the keys because, you know, it's a more effective dialing of the phone than with the soft feathers where you're just sort of touching the phone. Rooster pecked on the keys with incredible ease. They gathered around as it rang. It's ringing. You've reached the McPapers. Please wait for the paper. He took a deep breath. <gasps> then he sang. Farmer woke with a jerk. Oh, my joints are so stiff that they creak. My whiskers are stubbly. My stomach's all grumbly. It feels like I slept for a week. Well, Farmer, don't look at the clock. He joined them outside and pulled Rooster aside. Your crow has a bit of a screech. I see that you're sick and I've just got the trick. Oh, what is this trick? What you need is a week at the beach. Oh, no. Wah, wah. He just got sick at the beach. Oh, well, the farmer meant well. What, what, what is this? A, va a vacation request? Uh, uh, for when I can't how many days is how many days are these pecs <laughs> you can't take off that many days <laughs> because then we'll never wake up around here <laughs> well uh, okay fine if everybody gets a vacation I guess you get one too but uh, uh, can you train a replacement <laughs> you did already who me I'm gonna do it yeah, I think you need to work on him a little bit more. <laughs> well, see you next time, kid. I gotta go make sure that the rooster situation gets itself worked out around here. See you next time on, you know it. Ah!